Hi friends, hope you are fine. In this video, let us understand 10 different parts of a flower within 2-3 to three minutes. The first word is called the sepal. Sepal is small, leaf-shaped, often green-colored outermost whorl of the flower that encloses the developing bud. Group of sepals are called a calyx. The second whorl is called the petal. Petal is the beautifully brightly colored part of the flower, often with fragrance that is meant to attract pollinators. Group of petals is called the corolla. The third whorl is a male reproductive structure which is called as antrisium. It is made up of stamens. So this is anther, a part of a stamen, where pollen green is produced. So as you see, this is the anther. These are pollen sacs in which microspore mother cells forms, microspores or pollen grains. This is called the filament. It is the structure, long stalk-like structure that supports this anther. This anther and filament together forms the stamen, the male reproductive part of the flower. So the basic unit of antrisium or the third world is called the stamen. And the fourth whorl of the flower is the female reproductive unit which is called a skynesium. So this is stigma. Stigma is a part of carpal where pollen germinates. Then this is the style. Style is the slender tube that connects stigma to the ovary. Ovary is the enlarged basal portion of the carpal where ovules are present. Then this is the ovule. This ovule, the plant structure that develops into seed after fertilization, and this is the ovule. Female reproductive part that is divided into stigma style and ovary is called the carpal. It's often called as pistil also. So gynesium is the innermost whorl or the fourth whorl of a flower. The unit of gynesium is called as the carpal. Finally, two more terms. This is called as the pedicil. So let me make it more clear. So the stalk of a flower is called pedicel, whereas the stalk of an inflorescence group of flowers is called a spiduncle. Hope you understand 10 parts of a flower. Take care, stay blessed. Thank you so much for your support. You are with biologyexamsforyou.com.